This is my kitchen transformation. It starts removing all the doors. It's gonna take a while. I also remove everything from the cabinets. You'll be sanding later, you don't wanna dust and everything. After you remove everything, take it outside and wash it with uh, some degreasing, degreaser. As you do that, let it dry, sand it with the power machine. Both sides, front and back. Once you finish sanding with the power sander, go ahead and manually sand all the corners. You need to get to every single piece. Don't let any any place without being sanding down. Sand also the small doors. Just one side is good. And then go back inside and sand everything. I started with everything in and then I remove everything and I finish sanding. Start painting. I apply three to four coats rolling. You, you want to add a lot of coats when rolling, even though you might be using the best paint out there, just as, as I did. But to get better results, you want to have a lot of paint in there. So once you paint everything, let it dry. There's another coat. I also painted the indoors, the doors and the, the indoor part. About two coats is fine. You don't want to be, you don't need to be perfect there. It's a lot of work. Then take it outside and do the spray coats on the face of the doors. You gotta do that minimum three times so you have a, a, a gloss finish. And then assemble everything back. Hope you guys enjoy. It was a lot of work, but the end results uh, just looks amazing. It's a completely different kitchen now. more modern I guess so I'm very happy it took me a long time a lot of work but the results are great and on top of that I did save a lot of money by doing it myself hope you guys enjoy stay safe bye